You're late. I know. Someone smells bad. Yes, it's you. That's better. Channel 11 News here, folks. I'm Timmy. And I'm Scotty. The main topic of today will be cloning. Scotty, yeah, tell me. What's cloning? Well, pretty much clones are like identical twins. Their hmm. genes, they're 100% alike. But, well, clones, they're born at different times. Twins, same time. I'm confused. Are there any more differences between clones and identical twins? Well, yeah. Clones, scientists are involved with them, but with identical twins, not at all. How, how exactly can cloning be used well, in the real world today? Well, cloning could save farmers a lot of money. For instance, if you cloned a healthy cow, the farmer won't need to pump it with antibiotics, which can be costly. Also, if they cloned a cow which produced more milk at a fast rate, they'd get more money. Scott, I'm sorry about all the questions, but I just gotta know. Have scientists cloned anybody yet? Well, not really anybody, I'd say, but don't worry about it. Science have cloned many things, such as genes, cells, tissues, and even organisms, such as a sheep. Wow, that is out of this world. I know, right? Here's Sebastian with the news. There we go. Thanks, guys. Anyway, you can see it's very sunny out today, and it will remain that for the rest of the week. Anyways, I was wondering, how exactly are animals cloned? You know, Sebastian, that's a great question. Scott, do you want this one? Sure. Well, there are two basic ways that animals are cloned. One way is that you can remove the DNA containing the nucleus of the stomatic cell and inject it into the empty egg. The second way is by using an electrical current to fuse the entire stomatic cell with the empty egg. There you go. Thanks, and that's the one. You know, Scotty, I've been researching cloning, and I discovered that there are many laws in Minnesota about it. Did you know that in 2011, Governor Mark Dayton it vetoed legislation that would have prevented the cloning of human embryos. This means that some mad scientists out there could duplicate a human many, many times. It's just, it's just disappointing. This is sad. Calm down, <laughs> Timmy. That brings me to my next subject. Did you know that just about every farmer these days are researching and testing on cloning to get an advantage over the other farmer? Every day, researchers are finding more and more about cloning. So far, they found that using reproductive cloning, farmers can enhance the quality of their meat and their milk. Thank you for that very detailed answer. You're welcome, Scotty. And here's Teddy with the sports. Uh, mm -hmm. Thanks, guys. I'm Teddy, and I'm here to report your sports. Anyway, coming right up is the Youth Football Play of the Week. Yeah. Okay, let's go. But that's not why I'm here right now. I'm here right now to talk about cloning. You know, before my days as a sports reporter, I lived on the farm, so I not a lot, know a lot about cloning. The main question people ask me is who's all affected by cloning? And my answer is everyone. Everyone is affected by cloning, whether it's the people who eat the cloned animals or the farmers who are actually cloning it. Another question I get a lot is what's so controversial about cloning? And my answer is a lot of people think it's ethically and morally wrong, and some people think it's animal abuse. But I, I think it's alright. I think it's good for our science and to have better meat. Thank you, and that's the sports. Alright folks, we are nearing the end of the show, and we hope that you learned a lot about cloning. Before we go, sponsored by X. Get cleaner, so you can get dirtier. If you know what I mean. I want to thank you all for watching. Hey, teach me how to dug it. Hey, they be like smooth. What? Can you teach me how to dug it? You know why? Cause all the girls love me. Hey, all I need is a beat that's super. Thanks for watching, and that's the weather. That animals are cloned. One way 
is that you can remove the the DNA. Okay, we're gonna do that. Sorry. The, 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 the DNA. Basic ways that DNA is Go over it. Right. Oh. Oh. Did you know that in 1980, 2011, I'll just start That's the blooper. I'm Timmy Linquist and I'm your sports reporter. I'm not Timmy Linquist already. That's not the reason I'm here today. <laughs> Stop looking at me. Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> Scott, you're Thanks, guys. I'm Teddy, to hear, here to respond. Today to talk to you about cloning. La before I was a, back in the day, man, back in the day, before I was a sports reporter, I lived off religiously wrong and ethically wrong, because the, they just don't, aren't used to it. It's not, it's not our natural way of life, and so that's the answer. And a lot of people think it's also child abuse, and that's my answer to that. Here you go, guys. <laughs> child abuse. I said child abuse, didn't I? Just want to thank you all for watching. What one more try? <laughs> Just want to thank everybody for watching this. That would have been cool. Yes. <laughs> Let's try it again. As long as you love me. As long as you love me.